the mountains of Colorado, the beaches of California, the vastness of Texas. All of that is on the ice in Pittsburgh at the 84 Lumber Arena. Robert Morris University's men's hockey team has every direction of the United States on its roster. Um, actually, it's right outside Denver, uh, right up on the front range of the mountains, the Rocky Mountains. So I mean, it's like half hour to the city, a half hour up into the mountains. Probably five minutes from the rink I learned to grow up with. It's a tiny, tiny freezing cold rink that uh, no one really knows anymore. Mostly used for, used for beer league games, but uh, learned to skate there and then uh, moved organizations once I kind of outgrew that one. And... Uh, Temecula is in Southern California. It's in between San Diego and LA. Um, and it started off as kind of a small town. It's grown a lot lately. Uh, they're, pretty pop or they're pretty famous for uh, the vineyards. We have a lot of vineyards out there. And... It's, it's kind of outside of Dallas, like uh, 35 minutes away. I actually live in uh, Carrollton, which is kind of like a smaller, suburb, I guess, of Louisville. How did you start playing hockey, especially in Southern California? Yeah, um, I started off playing soccer, and then uh, I was riding a horse at my uh, dad's work, and I fell off and broke my leg. And then uh, when I was healthy, the only sport that had room was uh, hockey. And my parents figured they needed to put me in something. So um, yeah, I started playing ho or roller hockey and then uh, that slowly progressed and then I made, I made some friends that played ice hockey, uh, went to a birthday party, skated on the ice, loved it, and then uh, decided to give ice hockey a try. Um, I was actually the only kid in my high school that played AAA hockey. So it was kind of, at high school I was one kid and then at the rink I was a hockey kid. So it was, it was cool to get that feel where at high school I could go, I played on the lacrosse team at my high school. So I was able to have like just a normal high school experience without the hockey side attached to it. I'd have to miss a lot of school for uh, hockey. I did uh, external PE, which was, I took three classes and then uh, my fourth class was, I would leave and we had practice at four, so I'd have to race over to the rink. But uh, I mean, everyone played other sports or like had extra time to hang out with their friends, but I was, I was mostly, with, have to rush to practice and then mostly every every other Friday and Monday I'd, I'd miss school. What initially put Robert Morris on your radar? Um, for me it was, uh, you know, I wanted to go somewhere that it wasn't big enough to where I would get in and have to wait to play. Um, I wanted the opportunity to come in and kind of earn my spot. Uh, but having said that, I also wanted to go somewhere that was competitive, um, somewhere that looked like they were progressing. And so uh, I did some research and uh, kind of looked at the incoming classes and Robert Morris was definitely one of those uh, that fit what I was looking for. A uh, workman came and talked to me after the game and just said he was interested. And then I went to the NAHL Prospects Tournament halfway through the season. It's, and, uh, I talked to Schooley and I was talking to both of them uh, on the phone for about a week and then they offered me. So if you could go back to your childhood and maybe choose a different sport, whether it was lacrosse or any other sport, would you have done it? No, I definitely would have stuck with hockey. Uh, love, it more than, love it more than any other sport there is. Um, yeah, I miss skiing, I miss the mountains, I miss hiking and all that stuff, but there's nothing like getting on the ice and playing a game. I don't know, I tried to play football one year and I was wide receiver and I just kind of stood there and it was boring. I didn't, it didn't like please me, I guess. And I don't know, hockey's just, you're moving all the time and you gotta make plays, move your feet at the same time. And Yeah, I definitely would. Uh, I mean, I've played a lot of sports. Um, I rode dirt bikes growing up. I mean, there's nothing quite as fast and as exciting as hockey, so. That's one of the reasons I love it so much. Hockey isn't just Canada. It isn't just Minnesota or New England or North Dakota. It's not limited to geographic barriers. The sport crosses borders and lives in the heat of Texas and California and the landscape of Colorado just as it does in Moon Township.